Hey everybody, welcome back for what is a follow-up on Comforcer uh, CF3000 tires. These are on my 2015 F-150. We're going to do a review in two-wheel drive and four-wheel drive takeoff in some snow. Let's see how it does. And first I'll say sorry, it's kind of a crude review, but it's kind of just the best I could do right now. So um, let's uh, go ahead. I've got it in two-wheel drive right now. Let's punch it. I know that's blocking your view, kind of, but... Now, the truck does have stability, uh, advanced track or whatever, so... Like, I've got it to the floor right now. Um, but it does good to keep you on the road. Like, it doesn't want to spin out. But, okay, so that got us up to about 60. And I'm going to turn around and we will do a 4x4 launch and see how that goes. So you can punch it around corners in this truck and it handles really well. So some of it's not gonna be the tire, some of it's gonna be the truck in all fairness, but let's check out a four wheel launch. All right, we're in position for our four wheel launch. Let me try to hold the camera a little steadier. Let's go. So it does pretty good. Um, I know a lot of people were concerned about the tires, about um, quality and stuff, and a few people, I guess, have gotten bad runs of them or whatever, but obviously for me, I've obviously got a good set or something because I have no problems with them, no uneven wear. I've put a few thousand kilometers on them, no problem. Um, yeah, it, uh, it is what it is. Let's go back and do a donut. All right, I got traction control turned off. Let's That's good enough. Anyway, no tire reviews done without a little donut action. So, hopefully you guys have enjoyed it. Hopefully I wasn't covering the mic much. It's hard to kind of hold it and do this, but we will see you guys next time. Hopefully this helps out with your Comforcer 3000 uh, decision to purchase or not purchase. And as someone that's had them for several months, I'll say that overall for the price, value for the price, I thought they were worth it. So that's my official review. But um, watch some other videos and make sure you make an educated video. They're not going to compare to uh, Dick Sepix or, you know, another big name brand. But, uh, and sorry for the shaky, it's just hard to hold my phone like this but see you guys next time